Oh my God, dude. What's going on, guys? It's your boy, James here. Beards and Cards. Back in another video. If you guys are new to my channel, thank you for subscribing. You guys are just stepping by. Consider hitting that big red subscribe button down below. So now this is the second time I try to make this video because the first time I ran out of battery. So I've already been messing with my mustache here. And that's today's topic. Basically, my mustache. Uh, to all you guys out there that's got a big, fat, big, bulky, nasty, crazy looking stash man that's rocking it and you guys are able to do that <clears throat> more power to you man i'm not able to do that it drives me nuts so the last few months i've been growing my mustache and not trimming it um i did just trim it a little bit i'm not done yet it was actually the top here was actually just over my bottom lip if i, if I close it like this it was just over it and it's been driving me crazy all these longer hairs over here on the side they get off into my mouth when I'm eating, uh, especially depending on what I'm eating, and they get wet, and they're just doing this, and I'm chewing on them. It, man, it absolutely drives me crazy. So to all you that can do that, and it doesn't bother you, man, more power to you. I can't do it. So that's what I was doing just before my battery went dead, and I was completely rudely interrupted here by the video I was doing. As I was saying, I like to keep some aside so I could curl them out, but I was going to clean up right in this area, and that's basically what I was doing, all right? So we're going to get back to it. Trying to keep this on the sides as much as possible and just get this hair up off my lip. So I went in and trimmed some of this like this. And I like to just take this edge right here that don't have uh, any teeth on the very end. I like to take that and kind of just run that on my lip. And it kind of gives me something to go by there. So that's what I was doing. And then after I get that done, I like to come in and brush down like that especially right here in the middle areas. And I like to go in right here, like this, and cut off those hairs that are curling under and touching my lip that's driving me crazy. So that's what I'm gonna do now. As you guys can see, like I said, I'm running this edge against my lip. I'm just doing that basically. It doesn't cut because there's no teeth over here, but it gives you a good, helps give you a good shape just to run it across there like that. If you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm looking this mirror way over here, trying to make sure I'm not messing up, all right? I'm be making fun of my, my hearts over there, all right? <laughs> all right so i've got most of it up off my lip like i was talking about these hairs here i'm trying to live with these but these hairs here they're going under they're getting in my mouth they're getting wet um a lot of other things i could tell you but they're just driving me crazy so i'm trying to get those up off my lip and trying to see if i can let at least from here outwards grow so i can just kind of style it like that all right so that's what we're doing here let me see if I'm liking this and I'll come back to you. All right. Got a couple little, couple little hairs right in here. They're hanging down. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see them. Just a few of them there, right here. And right over here, I'm gonna try to get those out of here. I'm gonna have to look in this mirror where I can see good. Nice and easy, nice and steady. Gives you a nice shape when you run it across your lip like that. And like I said, when I'm done, sometimes I'll come in, brush it down, and I'll come straight in like this with the corner of it, with the edge right over here. Not the whole thing, because I'll just have a flat spot. I'll come in with the corner, kind of nip some of those hairs that are that don't look straight when you brush it down. All right, so from about right here, this way I'm gonna keep, 
And right here, this way, I'm going to try to trim both sides. And that's what I'm doing right now. Got a couple of little hairs here, a couple of hairs there, just to get those out of my mouth, and that ought to be, ought to be able to call it a day after that. Like I said, I got them turned. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I actually have them turned like that, and I'm coming in like that to get them hairs underneath. See what we got. <laughs> Whoo, boy. All right. So now that I got that all brushed out and cut, that's about what I'm going to stay with right there. Leave some of the length on the side so I can curl it up. But get this nice and trimmed. Got one little hair right there sticking down. Oh, there we go. Keep the center trimmed, for me anyways. Keep the sides where I can roll them out just a little bit. Because whenever I have this long, like I said, what happens, it gets all in my mouth. These end up getting in my mouth too if I can't keep them out when I'm eating. But these hairs here, it's hard for me to keep them out of my mouth when I'm, che when I'm chewing on food. So they end up getting soaking wet and they drive me crazy. And that's why I'm basically just trimming this up right here. But now that that's up out of the way, I can still keep some length on the side. And... Uh, yeah, I'm happy with that right there. So that's pretty much where I'm going to leave it for right now. I'm going to try not to mess with the sides and see if I can live with this because <clears throat> just yesterday I was eating some soup and all this and all this was all in my mouth and it was wet while I was chewing and I was chewing on basically my mustache hairs and that there is driving me absolutely crazy. So like I said, any of you guys that can rock a big fat mustache, um, more power to you, man. I don't know how you do it. This is the longest I've let my mustache grow and actually try to get these hairs down far enough to where I can get all of this combed out like that. And I can't do it. What I found myself doing is brushing these over to the side like this to keep them up out of my mouth. So I brush it all to the left like this. And I brush this like that. And that's basically what I do to keep it up out of my mouth. But now... I don't have to do that because it's all the same length except for the sides. So I can just roll the sides out. I ain't got to worry about this getting in my mouth anymore because it's up on the very, very, pretty much right there. The, not the, probably the top of my lip is about where it's sitting at. I'm about to roll these out and keep them away from my mouth. And I should be able to eat with no problems now just like this. Um, I like it. That's about all I needed right there. And, uh, yeah, sorry it's been a while, guys. Uh, like I said, I'm in the middle of a move, and uh, I'm still setting everything up, still moving stuff around, still hanging pictures. <clears throat> still trying to put my lights up, get everything situated just like I want it, and that alone is always overwhelming to do. I don't know if you guys, you know, some of you guys move one place and you're there forever. Me, personally, I've moved a lot over the last, I don't know, probably six years. I've moved probably eight times and I'm just tired of moving. Eventually I'll get to somewhere where I'm going to stay. But for right now, I'm going to be cozy and comfortable right here where I'm at. And uh, yeah, so I just want to bring this in, this video to you guys because I mentioned a while back that I was growing my mustache and this is about as far as I made it. Couldn't stand it all up in my lip. So this is where I'm at. Just like that, nice little clean arch right there with the sides out. There ain't no products in, so that's about all I can get out of it. Is how it looks there. And yeah, with that being said, guys, let me know what you guys can do on your mustache. If you're able to rock a long mustache or if you have to keep it trimmed like me. Um, and for those of you brothers out there that can keep it growing fat and just keep it going on out, praise you guys, man. I don't know how you do it, man. With that being said, see you guys in the next one.